What made me want to become a nurse is that I had, I had a passion basically for saving people's lives. But then later on, I developed an interest in eye health because I also had family members who had eye problems and I couldn't figure out what the problem really was. When I see a child with trachoma, I have a lot of mixed feelings. Uh, firstly, I feel uh, at some point uh, this condition, it's, it could be avoided. Had there been maybe one uh, a proper sanitation to prevent flies, and uh, two, maybe if there was uh, pro clean water available, and three, uh, if uh, there was proper hygiene at home, this condition could be uh, uh, avoided. If the condition goes untreated, you would know that this child at some point in time may end up blind, because trachoma is a blinding disease. So the feeling is like when someone goes blind, you know, it's, it's a burden to the family as well as to the community and to the nation at large. All the patients that we see, if it is a condition that you can actually maybe help someone to restore or improve their vision and that person appreciates, that is the best part of this job. There was this other lady, I think it was two years ago, she, she, she came to our eye clinic and she, she had watery eyes and a lot of tearing. Yeah. We examined her and we saw that she, uh, she, this lady had trachoma, she had discharge in her eyes and the eyelashes were turned inward. We had to take this lady to the theatre and do an operation. When she came after a week and uh, there were no more eyelashes rubbing on her and the cornea was recovering and she was now able to see I mean, it was so amazing because the lady could smile at you and they were not tearing and she wasn't complaining of pain anymore. But now she could see and the eyelashes were no longer rubbing or irritating her and she could actually put a smile and that also did put a smile on our faces. I think Zimbabwe may reach elimination of trachoma soon because uh, of lately, there's been a lot of trachoma mapping that has been going on and a lot of cases where have been identified. So I feel with the mass drug administration that are being done, they will help in the elimination of trachoma, yes. With more programs like this, I'm sure we'll reach that.